A studio monitor is a loudspeaker that is specially made for professional audio production. And for those people that are professional producers, is any of you guys into studio monitors? If you are looking for one, then let me tell you that the ones that I will mention in this video are the best ones that you can find for under $500. This may sound a little bit weird, but hey, what is the point of buying studio monitors at a very high price? And for, for those that already bought one higher than $500, I'm very sorry. Okay, let me start the list with the most famous studio monitor, which is the Yamaha HS8, which is the most flexible. Yamaha is a very well-known company when it comes to speakers, or in this case, studio monitors. This version of Yamaha, which is the HS8, is one of the best studio monitors from the company, which comes in two colors, which are the standard black and white. The dimensions of the studio monitor measures 13.1 uh, to 9.8 to 15.4 inches, and the weight are 10 kg, which makes this product a big one and not very light in weight. Differing from some other monitors that I will mention, this one can be purchased as one piece. It is a two-way speaker with an 8-inch woofer and a 1-inch tweeter. The monitor includes HS installed versions that make it installable on your wall or ceiling. The frequency response of the studio monitor is 30Hz to 30kHz and has a power consumption of 60 watts. The connectivity includes an XLR connector that is used in professional audio and a TRS uh, connector that is used for mono audio. This studio monitor also has advanced uh, noise reduction technology that neutralizes the sound before you can hear it. The speaker is also called the BI Amplified Monitor uh, since it uses two separate amplifiers. The first one for high frequency and the other one uh, for low frequency. Now, to whom do I recommend it? The Yamaha HS8 would easily be recommended to those people that are indecisive. Don't get me wrong, but I know that someone can decide where to put the studio monitors and with these, you can easily change the place of the studio monitors whenever you want. The second place is for the most feature-packed studio monitor, which is the GBL 308P MK2, which is best overall. Now, this studio monitor is considered as the, as the next generation speaker. The JBL 308P MK2 is the prettiest studio monitor that you can ever purchase. The two-way speaker with an 8-inch woofer and a 1-inch tweeter has a glossy pattern on the front part and a matte look at the, at the back. It has a very shiny look and measures 12.13 to 10 to 16.5 inches and has a weight of 18 kg which shows you that it may need a stronger person to move it around. A cute little detail about its design is that the speaker has a, an, uh, an LED light at the center where it is located the JBL logo. A very important issue for the monitor is that it has magnetic shielding which refers to blocking the magnetic field of the MRI magnet. Uh, the frequency response of this uh, studio monitor is 45Hz to 20kHz and power of 112 watts. It includes very flexible connectivity with XLR and TRS connectors and dual class D amplifiers that operate the sound to very high frequencies, which means that it is also a BI amplified monitor. It also includes a patented uh, slipstream, which is used for superior and amazing bass performance and the HF trim switch that adjusts the high frequency of the speaker. The sound quality in these speakers is very clear and precise. To whom do I recommend it? This pair of studio monitors, besides including a lot of features, also has a very shiny look. So if you want a very well featured and also pretty sound monitor on your studio or home studio, then the GBL 308 p MK2 is the right choice. The studio monitor that has the third place on the list is the, key, uh, is the KRK Classic 5, which is the most versatile. The KRK Classic 5 is a powered monitor, which means that it has a power amplifier built into the speaker cabinet. The two array speakers from KRK measurements are 15 to 12 to 10 inches and has a weight of 2 kilograms. It is a very flexible and has very lightweight for a studio monitor so that it can be moved easily. As an appearance, it has a woofer of 5 inches and a tweeter of 1 inch. The woofer of this speaker has a very light yellow color that makes it a little bit different and special for its design since none of the other have combinations of colors on the design. It has foam isolation to protect the surface of the monitor. The studio monitor has a frequency response of 43 Hz to 40 kHz and also power consumption of 220 uh, watts. The connectivity is pretty much universal with XLR, TRS, and RCA inputs. It has a system-optimized uh, auto limiter that prevents damages and delivers clarity at very high volumes of sound. It also has enclosures that protects the whole speaker. The Classic 5 also delivers increments of the bass response with the plus 2 decibel KRK bass boost. Uh, to whom do I recommend it? 
uh, well, since I mentioned at the beginning that these monitors are the most versatile, let me tell you guys that the versatility is considered as the name of these speakers. They are able to adapt any function or anything that you would like to use them for. The fourth studio monitor that I will mention in this video is the PreSonus Aries E4.5, which has the best wireless. The product that I chose to talk about from PreSonus has a complete difference from the three that I already mentioned because the, uh, this pair of studio monitors has a Bluetooth connection. As mentioned, the pair of PreSonus Aries E4.5 comes in pairs and each speaker measures 6.42 uh, uh, to 7.1 to 9.46 inches and has the lightest weight of 453 grams. They basically can fit anywhere. It is a two-way studio monitor that includes a woofer of 4.5 inches and a tweeter of 1 inch. The construction is made of wood and also has some plastic features on the front part. The frequency response is 35Hz to 20kHz and has a power consumption of 50 watts. As per its connectivity as a special feature of this monitor, we have the Bluetooth connection with the version of 5.0 that lets you listen to music and also you can create content totally wirelessly. Besides the Bluetooth connection, it also includes TRS and RCA inputs. When connected with a Bluetooth connection, it is compatible with any device that includes it and also while wired, you can connect it with your TV, computer or any other device that requires a wire. To whom do I recommend it? Since I am a fan of wireless products, I can imagine that many of you are. This product is directly recommended to those people that hate wired monitors and still couldn't find the best one to choose. PreSonus Edifier has a solution for you. Now last but not least, the cheapest product on this list is the Edifier R1280T, which has the best budget. The Edifier version R1280T is one of the cheapest products when it comes to studio monitors and besides that, it is a very famous product that is used by many people. Made of clear brown wood, this monitor speaker comes in pairs and measures 6.9 to 9.5 to 5.8 inches and has a weight of 4 kg per speaker. These speakers are two-way speakers that have a woofer of around 6 inches and a tweeter of 0.5 inches that gives us very great studio sound quality. The speakers come with a remote control but still, you also have the on-speaker controls that are located on the side of the main sound speaker so you have the full control for the volume and also bass add treble control which is used in sound production. The frequency response of this studio monitor is 75 Hz to uh, 18 kHz and it includes 40 watts RMS which tells us how much power can these speakers handle. The connectivity of these speakers is wired with the dual RCA inputs. These speakers let you connect with multiple devices. You can connect them to your laptop, PC, smartphone and even record players. Also these speakers are connected to each other with a regular normal speaker wire. And to whom do I recommend it? The recommendation of these studio monitors is pretty clear. Do you want a studio monitor that is the cheapest and yet has a lot of features? Give Edify R1280T uh, a deeper look because I think that you, may, you might like it. Conclusion It might sound that I am yelling to you guys, but these products make me fall for them. I hope you like them too and I would like to know from you if you own any of them or you are thinking to buy one of them. Tell me in the comment section down below and don't forget that the links are added for you so you can find more information about each product that I mentioned. I hope you liked what I, prefer, uh, what I prepared. Thank you for listening and I'll see you very soon. Peace out.